Hi guys and welcome to All About the Philippines. Now on this channel we've given you plenty of information uh, via our videos on how to find the right Filipina for you. We've got many videos out there including a 14 part series which is called Dating a Filipina Course which showed you how you can find your Filipina that is right for you. But the reality of it is, is that not everybody finds the right Filipina. So what I'm going to do today, I'm going to give you 10 signs that you're dating the wrong Filipina. And I hope for those people that are dating Filipinas that might not be really sure whether they're the right Filipina or the wrong Filipina for them. I'm hoping this video will bring about a little bit more clarity to you to know whether that relationship is worthwhile keeping or not keeping. So stay tuned. So don't forget guys, if you're enjoying the topics that we're bringing you on this channel, then be sure to subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell to get more videos. Now, the reality is when you're dating a Filipina is that some Filipinas are very good at manipulating or maybe even lying and tricking you into believing that they're really into you when really all they're after is your money. And the way to get around that and actually find out the truth is by looking at their actions rather than their words. She may say all these wonderful, nice, sweet things to you and you think, what a lovely girl. But then, if you ignore her actions, you're doing yourself a disservice and you're probably not seeing the real person that you're actually in that relationship with. So here in this video, I'm going to talk about 10 signs you're dating the wrong Filipina. Now, I'm sure we could come up with another 100 signs you're dating the wrong Filipina. So if you guys have any other signs that you want to put in the comments below so everyone can see and we can help each other out in the community that would be fantastic but today we're just looking at 10 signs you're dating the wrong filipina and here we go now we're not ranking these in any particular order it's just 10 signs you're dating a wrong filipina so the first one is that she resists webcam chat so no matter how much that you ask her to have a webcam chat she will resist that all along the way now there could be many reasons why she doesn't want a webcam chat but what i do know is all true and honest filipinas will be very keen to get on to webcam and see you and start to get to know you on a more personal level and if a filipina is resisting getting on webcam and and having a chat to you then you really want to ask yourself why and certainly examine her reasons why she doesn't want to chat with you on webcam very very closely now the next sign to look out for is that she will say to you she doesn't have facebook so you'll ask her for a facebook uh request and she'll say oh sorry i don't have facebook now the likelihood of a filipina not having facebook is very remote most filipinas do have facebook and in fact i think they're some of the highest users of facebook in the world and they do have a free facebook version in the philippines where it allow you to chat to her but it doesn't allow face to face video calls now the reason why i say you want to try and get have, have a look at a facebook is because you can find out a lot of information from her facebook account and the one you're really looking for is to see if she's genuine if the pictures on there are all the same if they're genuine or they look a bit too professional and also looking and seeing who's commenting on her facebook pictures and comments and to see if she's got any family members on there that make it look like it's a proper and true facebook account rather than something that's been manufactured by some scammer the next sign that you're dating the wrong filipina is that she's going to be giving you heart-wrenching stories she's going to be telling you 
how her mother or father is sick in hospital and they need a life-saving operation or they need this expensive treatment or medication. A variety of other stories that are really heart-wrenching, which is designed for you to offer her help and assistance. And we're talking about, when we say help and assistance, money. Because she knows that if she tugs at your heartstrings enough, you are going to put the offer out there and she's never even had to ask for the money. And you will think this is all your idea that you're helping her out when in fact she's played you and manipulated you to get exactly what she wanted. The next sign you're dating the wrong Filipina follows on from the last sign and this time she'll just plainly come out and ask for money. Now, all good, honest, true Filipinas are very proud and they won't ask for money from you, especially in the early stages when they don't know you. They'll just never ask for money. My wife never asked money for me once. And I think it was after we were married before she asked for $20. So be assured that a good, honest, true Filipina is not going to be asking you for any money. And if they are, especially early on, then you really need to have a good look at whether this Filipina is right for you and whether she's in this relationship for the right reasons or the wrong reasons. The next sign that you're dating the wrong Filipina is more about you than her. And it could be the only thing you find truly interesting or fascinating with this Filipina is her looks. So if you are so into her because she's a beautiful looking woman and there's nothing else there that really interests you about her, her personality, her likes, dislikes, all these sorts of things, her honesty, integrity, and all that, then you really need to have a good look and say, well, is this going to last full term or long term? Because the chances of a relationship lasting just because she looks good, well, it's certainly not going to last because everyone loses their looks after a certain period of time. She might be 25 now, another 20 years, she's lost those looks. Are you still going to stay with her then? And that's if you've lasted 20 years with her because I think you'd get very sick of that very quickly just relying on her looks as the only thing that's holding a relationship together. The next sign you're dating the wrong Filipina may be that when you went to the Philippines as a single guy looking for a Filipina, you went to the girly bars and you might have picked up a Filipina who's working there in a girly bar and you think now you're in love with her when maybe all she's in love with is your money. Now I'm sure there's some girls that work in that industry that are decent girls and okay girls, but the majority are really there just for money. They're not interested in you so much. They may say they are, but the reality is, is most of those girls don't really want a relationship with you. They just want to get what they can get out of you. Much better looking for a girl away from that sort of environment if you're looking for a true and long-lasting relationship. The next sign you're dating the wrong Filipina is that she'll say very little about herself and her life. She won't volunteer information when you ask questions. She will be just giving very short answers and holding back on details because she knows that way that she can't get caught out as easy. If she gives you a lot of detail, she has to remember a lot of things that may not be true. So by avoiding going into details on a lot of things about her life, then she can maintain that facade very, very easily over a longer period of time. Hence, she can get more money from you as time goes by without getting caught out. Now, the next sign you're dating the wrong Filipina is that she will resist you meeting her family, friends and co-workers. And the reason for that may be that she could even be married or in a relationship with some other guy. And she's doing this to make a living, to feed her family at home. She may have kids. She says to you she doesn't have kids, but she could have kids at home and the husband's looking after those kids while she's out there working on you to see what she can get out of you. 
Remember, guys, a good, honest Filipina will be proud to introduce you to her friends, family, and co-workers. She won't want to hide you away from them. So if she's making excuses or she's saying no, she doesn't want you to meet them for whatever reason, then that is a huge red flag and something I would not accept. You have every right to meet her family, friends and co-workers if you wish so you can talk to them and find out more about her as well and get to know these people because if the relationship goes forward, they could very well become your family. Now the next sign that you're dating the wrong Filipina is that she'll do things for you but always wants something in return. Now, most Filipinas who are genuine will do because they want to do and they won't expect anything back. So an example of this might be that you could be in that long distance relationship thing where you're actually chatting to her and you could be chatting to her on Skype or whatever on video call and she might be looking to get some money so she might even offer to take a close off for you online and maybe do certain things online for you in return that you help her out as well. Now some guys think this is great and they're happy to do that but in reality if you're thinking about a long-term relationship with this woman then you really need to use some common sense here and understand that she's only doing this to get what she wants. So you need to ask yourself if you're going to be made a fool for this Filipina. Now my last sign that you're dating the wrong Filipina is that she refuses to get a cinema which is a certificate of no marriage in the Philippines. Now I would suggest that you ask her that to get this early on in the relationship so when you think okay you're getting a little bit serious about her and you think she could be the right Filipina I think that's the time to actually ask her earlier rather than later in the relationship and by her response you will know if she's genuine or not. There are such things as couple scams going on in the relationship which are couples are married Filipina and Filipino and they do a love scam on a foreign man trying to get money out of him pretending to be in a relationship with him so she can just draw as much money as she can out of him over a period of time and even if you go and visit her in the Philippines she might spend time with you and the husband will let her go and spend time with you because they're working in this together and they've got a plan to, to scam you out of whatever they can. It could even be as much as getting a house and land out of you, which has happened before many times. And all of a sudden you go back to the Philippines after being away for six months and find out there's a husband living there with kids and she tells you to go jump. She doesn't want you anymore. And because you can't own land in the Philippines, you've got no claim. And yes, these things do happen from time to time. So protect yourself and ask for that cinema. If she says no, then you know what you need to do. You need to get away from her and find somebody who will say yes to getting a cinema. Okay, guys, I hope this video has given you a little bit of clarity and direction around whether you're dating the right or wrong Filipina. And of course, you know what to do if it comes out you're dating the wrong Filipina. If you've enjoyed the video, give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to share the video with all your networks. And of course, subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell to get more videos. Thanks very much for watching, guys. I appreciate all your support. Take care and bye for now.